Turning now to our economy. As Fairhope continues to grow, two businesses are making some big changes. News 5's Brianna Hollis joins us now live from the Fairhope Pier to tell you more about what we can expect. Well, Mel, for anyone who lives around here who may not have been walking down by the water in the last week or so, that yellow sign right there is going to be unfamiliar to you. It says, coming soon, the pier, bar, and grill. That will actually be taking the place of shucks on the pier. Meanwhile, Inland, a Fairhope Brewing Company, just launched these today. When Fairhope Brewing Company opened in 2013, you could only get a taste of their cold ones on draft. They eventually expanded to bottles, and now, thanks to this new number, cans. It's a six-head filler right here, so it fills six cans at the same time. Other big thing, it's better for the beach. It's better for the boat. It's, it's just better all around. There are a lot of places that you can't bring glass that you can bring cans. Speaking of the beach, if you're taking a stroll down there, you'll notice a big name change. That iconic Shucks logo, gone. And its place, the pier. A lot of people didn't identify with the name Shucks. And so we thought, well, it's, I've always I've grown up here. It's always, hey, you're going to the pier, the big pier. That, you know, so we're going to just go with that. We're going to call it the, the Fairhope Pier Bar and Grill. The spot is completely closed right now, but will reopen under the same ownership, just with a revamp. And really accentuate the bar, happy hour, five days a week. Uh, also going to do a six-month run, I think, of, of uh, sunrise breakfast. And whether we're talking just a beer or a full bar itself, both parties are looking forward to growing just like the city is. We hope that adding this canning line will increase our productivity by at least 15% and up to 30%. We're excited, man. It's really going to be great. God willing. Now, the pier is set to open sometime in early April, and these cans are available at certain grocery stores here on the Eastern Shore. They'll be expanding into Mobile next week. Reporting live in Fairhope tonight, Brianna Hollis, WKRG News 5.